Hi guys, today we're going to read No David by David Shannon. No David by David Shannon. Title page. To Martha, my mother, who kept me in line then, and to Heidi, my wife, who keeps me in line now. This is an author's note. It says, A few years ago, my mother sent me a book I made when I was a little boy. It was called, No, David, and it was illustrated with drawings of David doing all sorts of things he wasn't supposed to do. The text consisted consisted entirely of the words no and David. They were the only words I knew how to spell. I thought it would be fun to do a remake celebrating those familiar variations of the universal no that we all hear while growing up. Of course, yes is a wonderful word, but yes doesn't keep the crayon off the living room wall. David's mom always said, No, David! He's drawing on the wall. Oh, my. No, David! Look, I think he's trying to reach the cookies. He's standing on the tiptoe of the chair. Oh, my. No, David, no. Oh, he trailed a trail of mud through the living room on the carpet. Hmm. No, no, no. I think his bath is getting a little out of control. Very lot of water. Come back here, David. Oh, my goodness. David, be quiet. That is not quiet, is it? Sometimes we just feel like making a lot of noise. Don't play with your food. That's a neat little man. That's enough, David. Oh, my. Superman, go to your room. Hmm. Settle down. Stop that this instant. Yuck. Put your toys away. Not in the house, David. I said no, David. Oh, he didn't listen, did he? There's his baseball. It's very sad. Davy, come here. Yes, David. Hugs make things better, don't they? Who's the main character in this book? That's right, David. David is the main character. He's the only one we hear a name for, isn't he? Through the whole book. We'll talk about him when we do our book report later this today.